Saturday, February 2nd. I just I just came back I just came back watching the uh, premiere episode of Power Rangers Mega Force and I have to say this season is the shit. No offense, but really, yeah, I didn't mean to say it like that in that manner because I was just so thrilled just after when they after when Nickelodeon showed that uh after when I, I had to wait until uh, that NFL cartoon went off on Nickelodeon and waited for the premiere episode of Power Rangers Mega Force, which followed it. And I have to say, Mega Force is going to be a good Power Rangers show. This is going to be the best of the bunch, the best of the 20 seasons. And way better than Samurai. Now, um, the plot is not so simple about the, uh, the first episode anyway, because, you know, we're going to have new episodes the following Saturdays after this one. And, um, this episode reminded me so much of Day of the Dumpster from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Except, well, you know, this is 20 years later, and even though Mighty Morphin, even though Power Rangers started out, uh, came out in August of 1993, but this is 20 years later. This is February of 2013. And, well, we know come August 28th, 2013, the show is going to be fully 20 years old. But this is season 20. 2020. And, um... Let me, let, let me make, let me break, make, make, let me make, let me break it, break it up to you about this episode. I know for those who have not watched it uh, later on, uh, hours ago, um, we know the, the basic, uh, thing was, the, sh the episode opened up with the, uh, Monta this dream sequence of Troy dreaming of all the Power Rangers in this ultimate war, which we'll see later on in the series and such. He's he's a newcomer. He comes to school. He goes to the school. Is I don't think it's Angel a newly constructed Angel Grove High School or anything because we ha I mean the Power Rangers haven't had Angel Grove around for, since um in space so. But um, we do meet these other four Rangers, which I which I forementioned in the last video last night. Gia, Emma, Jake, and Noah, and um, they're also high school students too. We well, like MNPR, the the Rangers in this season is set in high school. Um, we do meet up with a new team of villain. We do meet up with a new villain, new villain army, the War Star, the same name as the main villains of the Ghost of Ghostager. Um, and then we also have. Go see. Um, I also noticed what really freaked me out a little bit when Troy, Jake, Noah, and uh, Gia came into the new command center, and when, well, when actually they, in teleportation wise, and when they met Tensu, and when Gosi introduced himself to the new Mega Force Power Rangers, he said that he is the mentor. He was Zordon's mentor. That kind of freaked me out a bit. I, did, I, I knew where Ghostface's background was coming from. As soon as when I saw his face on the wall, I knew he was going to be like Zordon in this season. And Tensu is Alpha, like Alpha in this season. But he's a small, wheelie-looking Transformer robot. Um, or more like Wally, -E. More like Wally -E of Power Rangers. So... Tensu introduces the, t the teenagers, the new teenage, the new generation of teenagers with attitude, with the with the with the Mega Force powers, giving them power cards. You know, like the power card, like this Red Ranger power card card that I have that came with the toy. Um, but this is the toy version, not the usual, not the actual thing. Um, the Ghostly Morphers, when they pull it, and when they go like, you know, they slip a card in and do like and do like this, and then. Special effects with the weapons and stuff pop up and such, you know. And then, then, the, then they go out into the city, and then they fight these green-looking insect troopers that are more like the putties and stingwingers combined together, but they're green-colored, hazmat-wise or something. And as soon as as soon as the teens regroup, they become the Mega Force Power Rangers. And what also shocked me is when they. Yell is when they say it's Morphin time. I liked it that. A nice throwback to the original Mighty Morphin Roots. Thank God, Saban, you gave us a finally decent Power Rangers show. I mean, unlike Samurai, which was, you know, bullshit, and I think this wasn't really the Power Rangers season you really wanted to do anyway because 
it was crap. I know you wanted you did Samurai just only for a come you know for Power Rangers' comeback and popularity and the ratings and stuff. After it's been you know 15, 17 seasons, 15, 16 seasons of the show's decline in the ratings and popularity, while other kids' shows start to um, over jump Power Rangers throughout its popularity, like you know. And anyway, back to the show. After the and also their morphing sequence is awesome. But even though it's a little slow when they do a flip back, it's similar to the uh, SPD morphing sequence, the, sp the morphing sequence of the Rangers from Space Patrol Delta. But I I like the way how he utilized how he chroma keyed the Ranger the the American Mega Force Rangers with the Japanese Gosager morphing background. I like that. I mean, but Samurai's morphing sequence just really bugs the hell out of me. The, the white guy, the black guy, I mean, actually, the, what, the white stoner guy, the black, the black over-determined guy, the pink doo-doo face looking, uh, the, 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 uh, the Asian doo-doo face looking girl in the pink, the, the funny, the funny, uh, Latino guy in green and the yellow little girl, the yellow, little girl in yellow thing, I just, please, but, the mega, the open, the uh, the morphing sequence in Mega Force reminds me so much of the morphing sequence in Power Rangers in Space, also, but except it's red, blue, black, pink, and yellow. But even though in Space it was red, black, blue, pink, and yellow in its episode, the Rangers uh, fight these whoever these green um, henchmen are in this season. But I'll, I'll get to know who they are again. Um, their monster, I couldn't catch up his name, but. Uh, the, the, the monster that they first fought in this episode today, I couldn't get his name. He was on this rock, this rock, this this rock that you know rolls and rolls and and then also the range. I also like the way how they use their uh um the weapons that they uh actually I think I already talked about the weapons already. But anyway, this episode was the shit. This season is going to be the shit. And it's going to be twice as better than Power Ranger Samurai and whatever other Power Ranger show before that was, you know, crap. Mainly, this is going to be the best season since Mighty Morphin from 20 years ago. This is 20 years later, people. A new era has begun. This is going to be the most rocking year for Power Rangers. I can't wait. So what do you guys think about Power Rangers Mega Force so far? Even though we're just only one episode, one episode in, and we're about to go on with the next, you know, thirty-nine episodes. So, put a, please put a comment on the on bottom of the screen, and also subscribe to uh, PR Lost Galaxy 2014 and me. You know who, um, you know. So see you later. I'll check check on you guys with a new um, video extra about Power Rangers Mega Force. It's about to, it's about Dark Fall, so I have to um call it a night, so see ya.